Thanks for messing around in Vampire Survivor's Best with 297. We got some Brad Fang action, but not on this section. We got instead Brownie, Horse, Bill Riser, and Lance Bean, who immediately gets a chest. Horse, here's. On the back end, I am listening to Matara Khan play Warhammer 40k, Speed Screen 2, The VOD on YouTube. I do not know if I'm watching it. This is part two. It's going on to Mechanicus Divinitus, but searching for Luz on the second planet. Okay, yeah, something weird just happened. But I don't want to get rid of my footage because, well, I do have some time before this has to go up. I don't want to re-cut it. Re-footage it. Dick up here. Huh, actually, I think the start of this mission might be uh, visible from one of the operations, the second operation, huh? She's testing out with the power sword and campaign. I did not realize what it did, and now there's an ad, which I will have to skip because skip an ad. Hell. Oh, she got inged? Huh, weird. Okay, well, she figured out that the power sword has stance system sooner than I did, so hey. Any power thing breaks shields? Uh, so, oh man, today we just ended up being such a disaster. Short, not particularly interesting space marine -in. Not much in the way of chat, though thanks is always 177. At least I got to get my Voltron on. Uh, I played one round of Scout to uh, limber me up before I did this, and something messed up with its counting, and it didn't count towards the weapon I was using at all. It counted it sort of towards Vanguard. Scout doesn't get Melta. It said I got two Melta levels, and then two levels on Scout, which, well, my Scout's maxed out, so shouldn't it be happening? I almost wish I'd remember to screenshot it because it was so weird. Oh man, my donation was also just a disaster. Just bad every second of it. Which is quite unfortunate. Still got paid, but man, I don't like not giving up the plasma. And blood. Gunky gunk. Blast. Blast. I'll give out all the fluids I can. She's experimenting with the stance. Um. Yeah, she... Oh, hey. Okay, I can grab that wings. Lucky luck there. Oh, man. Brownie's actually kind of bad to play. Because he's, he's about not moving in the end. Oh, man. No, I do not use photo mode correctly at all. I also didn't know... Did I... No, I had a screenshot of the five planet stuff. I guess I just never recognized the battle barges. Destroy! Destroy! Oh, and... Uh, oh, wow, a golden finger. Huh. Probably should have waited till horse came back up. Random golden finger is... Very rare. It's got a very tiny hit chance of actually popping up. And I'm not going to get much out of this. Golden Finger is fairly weak. Well, I got some chickens, I guess. 
Ah, yes, of course. Who needs empty home? Well, eventually Bill's gonna pick it up. Probably when I'm level 800. Oh, he popped her righteous fury because her fake nails. Ouch. Well, it's only gonna be the first fights during it. Honestly, you know what annoys me more about that scout run? But I was doing so well till the end. I had taken a smidge of health till the very last section when the Carnifex showed up on Ballistic Engine. And then it just cheaped around, hit me for my full health bar three times because I had stims. And then I went from what was probably going to be like low double digits damage taken to actually losing out on the thing. Because we had a tactical marine that did absurd. Absolutely crazy. Oh, hey, Arcana Goblin. Gimme, gimme. Perry, 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 Perry spams go. Oh, Gadriel, you and your bloodlust. Uh, da -da -da. Gotta rescue Luz first, then it's... Chaos! I should probably put a warning about face point spoilers, but... Well... There's, like, two people that watch these, so maybe this far, anyway. My retention rates are so bad. Well, Dex has put out another video, so that'll make it even worse. Man, all the way at the end here. Org. Bug on bug. Violins. Random parry. Wait. The hell? Get all multi Ooh, double. If I am this, y'all ready for this? Da 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 Burn the idol. Good grief, another ad already. It's been like six minutes. I get, if I ever get ads, which is incredibly unlikely, I'm gonna specifically make sure that they go up between sections for my chapters. Makes it obvious for certain videos. Well, hmm. I guess that'll finally be a reason to go back and play old ones. Or go and shift off the old stuff. Oh well. Didn't? Hmm. You know, I don't think there's anyone I'm gonna really be watching tonight play stuff. That's why I'm on VOD, but I don't think Mori's playing Dark Souls. They got perms for Space Marine 2, so that's woohoo. Can't wait to see that happen. Open chest me. Oh, that's a Guardian Relic she already grabbed. Damn her baby. Not a gamer, baby. She's a gamer, a stalt. Ooh, ooh, yeah. Ooh, Sonic Bloom, Sonic Bloom, Super Sonic Bloom. Uh oh, my chest in this high. And Bill gets it. Well, Mini Horse goes to. Or Lance gets the empty tome, while Bill gets Mini Horse. Go, go figure. There's my wave beam, so I can stop, you know, doing anything. Alright, I could have grabbed Mad Groove to get Bolero off that. Oops. There's a grenade around here. Oh well. Let's do Phoenix Blasting. 
Bex put out a video about overpowering Karelo. And even with overpowering Karelo, it's still Karelo, so it's still really bad. Like, uh, I'm doing half the damage he was at this time. Without even remotely being as powerful. With the Phoenix Blast, that's how bad Karelo is. He was at like hundred thousands. Uh oh. Oh, Ravenard. Yeah. <laughs> Unironically ran into a Ravener. <laughs> In that sniper match before this. And he got rolled. It was horrifically bad how bad it got beaten. In. Yeah, it was the simplest Ravener fight ever. Or... Fire, 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 blast, fire them all. Now I'm thinking about it, I could go the perfect dodge on Sniper for Cloak. Break out of that with melee and then gun strike after. That'll do more damage than gun striking. It does take a bit for gun strike to fade. Oh man, I'm talking about like three different things because there's nothing to talk about vampire survivors, right? <laughs> you get chests at least. No future for the bad guys. Ah, you stupid guy. My Tarkon, 2024. I need to double check. Or he said she wouldn't be playing Dark Souls 3 today, but... He also said she'd be starting at certain times that never got played. Alright, so let me check that real quick. Okay, so she's got something set up for about three hours after, well, than my current time. But will it be Dark Souls 3? Will it be not Dark Souls 3? Either way, it should be something fun, right? Right, right? It's right there on the tile. Right, right, right? Have some fun. Eyeballs! Destroy all the eyeballs! Stick a needle in your eye, like I had needles in my veins. I got stuck so many times. My veins are a wretched nonsense. I don't even have the excuse. Uh, I can guarantee... Paranormal scan this way. Slowly. Got yeah, big paws of fist. Gonna get a mini ghost out of one of these, eventually. Wait, no, he needs to be level 2 first. Oops. Smash crate. Smash! Yeah, that's a very big photon storm for... How honestly kind of low my level is. It'll get Greatest Jubilee from Forsen, so that'll get me some extra vacuums. She had a shock grenade before. Oh, she's... There's the vacuum. God, no. I do not care about Vata Vidya. I do not need an hour video about the lore of Bale. He was a giant prick of a dragon who fought Placidus Axe and then left to go terrorize other people. There, that's his lore. I don't need an hour to tell me that and make things up. Do you need an hour to do that? I don't. I'm annoyed that it keeps getting recommended to me so strongly. I have not watched... I've like watched like one video of his ever. 
People get their head cannons in place, and then anything that goes outside of it. I'm a veteran of the Fire Emblem Three House. is worse for a reason. Hell, the only reason I stopped was that whole thing. Ow! Why? I had you. No, the battery can't be low. Yeah, anything. That should be the controller that's the most full. Still have four more stages after this. Jeez. I started this one way too late. Yeah, well, I had to get the wraps off my arms first. They were really annoying before I did anything. And my arms are still hurting. Yeah, the warrior brood with the venom cannons. Well, so it's technically their venom brood, since they're the ranged version. But they are warriors. Well, regardless of anything, they're definitely one of the most annoying ones. Like, the corrosive devourer one's no trouble there. Yay, Bill! Aren't really a trouble other than the fact that they can inexplicably do high damage. Times. <sighs> Giving him the paranormal scan took away the mini ghost because why well, wouldn't it? But I still have the life sign scan, so does that mean I can still get mini ghost picked up again? I mean, in theory. Your Jisoo can come back if you use up the first one and it leaves your part. Machine God can't set us free. We have to seize the means of production ourselves. You are not immune to propaganda, says Garfield. No, it's, it's not propaganda. It's the celestial truth. Ouch, stop. Oh, just endless weapon pickups. Orc. Why did you spoil there to be chaos in the game? I mean, obviously it's going to happen, and she's already seen them. But still, stop spoiling things. So many people just spoiled... Oh, Dark Souls 3 from Mori. Yeah, Wave Beam. Doing the work. No, wait, Photon Storm doing the work. Huh. All right, and leading the expedition into Abyss Foscari is Brownie, who I get mad real with, then Boomlight Bolero. And there's Horse there. As well as Brad Fang and Mega Impostorina. In the background is Matar Khan playing some Warhammer 40k Space Marine 2. She's a bit into the second world. Uh, get home. And Brown. No, no. Alright, grab everything fast as possible. That's good. Academy badge. Hold off Academy badge. Hmm. Okay, that's fine for right now. Gotta make sure Tome levels up first. We have another mini... Oh, no, that isn't even Mad Groove. What caused all that? Oh, duh, random event. Uh, Matarakon, second vow of Space Marine 2. Uh, just doing some stuff on the second planet, looking for a lose. Then, character name, not. Uh, she's just still fighting some more Tyranids. And, uh, well. Good stuff. As you do. Maybe she'll melee stuff, as she should. 
And I should switch over to actually watching her. So there it is. Oh, okay. She's with that really awful, like, split roof path battle. Oh, man. With all those warrior venom birds shooting across the gap that you have a really hard, difficulty time hitting. Back at. Oh, mini engineer can show up. Yeah, there it is over there on horse. Somewhat helpful. 52 of them needs to be maxed out first before I grab any more pickups. Armor is here. Yeah, only one rank on the armor. Would have been a bad idea to grab it. Come on! Oh, crud. Thought I was further down than that. Well, here we go with one. Oh, lucky. Is there another NFT? Okay, then I can start taking down more. Well, I can save it for taking down more. This was an accident. Uh, oh, why? Oh, right, a tractor. Oh, there's a mini engineer maxed out, so that's crosswires ASAP if it goes correctly. And down sight. Wait, she has a plasma? Yeah, she has a plasma pistol. She can charge her shot. I wish I was your real dad. Then I could rely on you for income and only play video games myself. Right, double armor. Go, go figure. Oh. Losing isn't fun. Why'd you go that way? Uh, I still thought Megala would be a medium. A chosen one. Fire breathing again. Oh, Brad gets it. Oh, there's empty tome. Good. Or. Oh, man. Oh, I've. I think I forgot to turn off Cursed, didn't I? That would explain things. Last Fusel. Last Fusel everything. Last Fusel. NFT? Rosary. Gotta keep Brownie nice and healthy. Grenade. And another golden egg for Brownie. And there's a car to blow up. The heck? Why do we have an invincible burning car here? Chest. Duplicator, that's helpful. Stressful game, and who wants that? Display vampire survivors and win. Oh, my eyes are burning again. Occasionally, it just happens. My eyes just start burning up like they've got shampoo dripping in them. Weird. All right, there's empty tome maxed out. And not a single Bolero. Or a single Arcana chest has shown up. Arcana Goblin. Okay. Hmm, should I wait for... Lucky Swipe to be picked up full? Three... I don't know, is Shadow Servant worth it if I can't upgrade it? It does do a lot of damage, apparently. Gaunts! Kill the Gaunts! Now I get that Flames of Competition. Gaunt section. Add. Oh great, what is this? Uh, 
Well. There's three skulls. Been on my deal a fourth, but can't do it a fifth. Over. Wait, is that a sort of online thing? Well, I don't care. I have no opinion whatsoever, Sword Art Online. I have not watched it, I do not care to watch it. Anyway, she's... Yeah, she's on the list section with the Gaunts and Gargoyles, right? Is she? Uh, hmm. There's a wave beam. Don't. Hey, Arcana Chest. Now I can get some glorious, glorious Sound Old Sanctuary. Space Marine! We all the Empire's Fury! The hell did that come from? Oh, Brad had it. How long has he had it? Ugh, that's annoying. Okay, so I can grab these now. This is fine. Get rid of these just so they're not in the way. Did I hit the... I did. Unfortunate. Right, and this can be a life sign scanner. Whoa. That was dangerous. Wait, is that old Antonio on the card? I actually deciphered it. It's way... In a different video, way earlier one. I think in a Geno video. So it shouldn't be too hard to find. Oh, hey, another wing. Oh. Oh, not another wing. Oh, yes, another wing. The other one was on the last round. Oh. Quite large. Oh. Uh, Close on draws and over me. Well, the chest is necessary to get the mini ghost. Wait, hey, where the hell did you get spinach? Oh, you picked it up from a chest. So. Um. Yeah, what would I even want for other weapons? Laurel, maybe. That's not the worst idea, I guess. Okay, she she's officially on the defense section now. She was just getting to the left, now she's on the left going up. And dealing with gargoyles. I haven't actually... Okay, yeah. Even she's feeling the difference between the AI because she played this after the patch. Like, between the patch where they are, we're less effective against the gargoyles. So that's good. Not my mini ghost yet. I got my Luminaire. Next cross wires. That chest would have come back up to me eventually, but grab it now. And I just wait for Mad Groove to move everything, pick it all, and then win. Man, that prism lasts as far and so fast it's not even animating correctly. That's our bad.
I mean, I don't think... I don't think Nids have parents. They're just created from biomass from the high mine. It's like saying if you're a Lego man's had a mother or father. Even if they could hit things of their own volition. Power attack. Get that execute on that gaunt. Yeah, smash it good. Most important lessons is making sure that you can get those executes and gun strikes on the gaunts and gants. And they got Zangors. Zangors and Jangors. Uh, hands off controller moment. Oh, wait. Lifeline scan needs to be two before mini ghosts. Okay, it can't show. Oh, you have mini ghosts down there, mini. Big horse. And a vacuum, too. 29 on a veteran. Man, I should have gone and wiped my face off. This painful. Well, at least it's not when I'm live streaming with Casper. Oh. Uh, good God, another ad. God, I think it's like the fifth or sixth ad. It's been less than half... Like, maybe a bit over half an hour. And time warp. We're not losing. Time warp. We're a winning. Time warp. Don't you stop. Now. Alright, Cosmo doesn't start with weapon. So, time warp into paranormal scan. Getting them Crystal Cry bonuses going. Uh, so, Bolero into a second. Silent Old Sanctuary. Wicked Season. Two, three, four. Four from the start. Boogaloo is fine to put it out with Wicked Season. But no, you need Impost Tongue for a third for that Wicked Damage. Nope, that was not scripted. Crack grenade. Oh, mini horse. Well, I suppose it makes sense. Yeah, that's actually a pretty fast kill ratio. I don't need Bolero right away. I mean, it helps, but... Three. Huh. It all has to be on Postcard. It's just the most efficient. But, yeah, you need Inverse. You... Bolero is starter. Bolero is starter. Final Sanctuary from Inverse Merchant. Go down there and grab Wicked Season. Hey, another Arcana Chest. Then the sheer luck from it will help get you up through it. Then you hit Sapphire Miss for double shots of paranormal scan. Seal out and banish everything you don't need. Only three weapons. I get that scaling on the pasta tongue. But time warp to get crystal cries. That's what I was saying. Time warp for. Hmm. If you go that way, you can go Sarabande and I'll do more damage. You need a lot of parts.
Man, you need so many arcana. Just a lot of dice rolling. It's feasible. At least one that will usually show up is Bolero. And the sheer number of chests helps keep your build online much quicker. Well, let's tell him Metaglio win. Yeah, it's painful. Well, I don't even have an academy badge, Max. Huh. Thought I had a lot more levels than this. There we go. Orcs! God, this is painful. Actually, just keeping my eyes just stop from being as painful. Boy, happy. All right, nice clean victory. A nice clean victory in Abyssal's card. Pulse rough cut next. Can't be Neil Gallagher or Hectic Highway. He's on break, and death is here, and death is frozen. Eight million with the wave beam, two with hats, four with time warp, and ten with luminaire. Huh. Alright, more vampire survivors, more Matara Ken playing Space Marine 2. She did not wash her hands after a break, ew. Cockroach woman, as you'd expect from one like that. This is Polis Ravica with Brownie, Brad Fang, Sheena is Razi, with Colonel Bahamut, and yet another bloody ad. Oh my god. Screw you, you two auto ads. Screw you. Not that I'm going to be able to get to ads at any point, but. Probably not even going to get three. Uh, let's see, what is it? It's like. Three months off. So I, if I was getting like one sub a day, I'd be at like two bit sixty ish. I'm only at two hundred and three, but thanks to anyone who did sub or watch this far. All maybe one of you. So I hope you have a good day. Oh boy, this is. Forgot to get Mad Groove again. Forgot to get Mad Groove again. Just, you don't want to get Mad Groove all that often. Ah, Spellstorm. Oh no, I did turn Kurt off. First off. I'm just really bad. It felt like it because I was that bad. Uh oh. He failed the gargoyle section. Might be failing it again. Okay, let's get that. Nice six to nine. Funnily enough, well, my blood pressure... No, not my blood pressure. My heart rate was. Nice. My blood pressure, on the other hand. <laughs> Oh, I'm surprised I haven't had many, many heart attacks with how bad it is. Holy. No, the game is bad. Don't blame yourself. Blame something else. Save your ego. Oh, man. Barney's going down, too. Chicken. Chicken. Chicken, chicken. Chicken. Uh, not necessary chicken, but I'll grab it. Oh, you're going after Brownie. Yeah, switch between them. Gaunts and Sif. Blast with the wings of fire. Man, I lost so much health there. 
Okay, that's safe for now. Find your crack. Mmm, yummy crack. Delicious crack. Oh, wow, they did so much. Well, at least... Uh, Sheena? Yes, let's go, Sheena. Swearing on my family-friendly radio recording. How dare you. Wait, where aren't these chickens dropping? Rapid fire. Uh, another rapid fire, and another rapid fire. Okay, these rock guys are down, now it's space water time, which is much more manageable. Gina down, so that's less manageable. He's improving, but... No, Colonel! Colonel! Alright, if I can just protect the Colonel, he'll protect Brownie. And sort of protect Sheena. Not very well, but he can. Well, this is not good. Charge! Charge! Why did the cars not explode? Oh, there's a chicken! And a rosary! Hearts! Hearts! Ouch. I keep thinking they're gonna explode, but no, they're just damage areas. Oh, the orders aren't too troublesome. Take damage, save time. Take damage, save time. Get them speed run strats down. Medic, hey, saved. Take the wins you get. It's only when you want to be skillful. I wish I was aggressive heavily. Long nails. No Elden Ring for Mataracon. Oh, did I even say it was Matara? Well, by now I should be obvious. And that's what the description is for. Effie Bolt Rifle is terrible. No, don't touch it. Oh, boy. Oh, snuck around. What pizza ad is this for? Okay, yeah. Little Kaisers. Kaiser! I will not be wrong like you. Oh, Pixel Remaster, I wish I could play you. Well, I can! It's on Xbox, woo! Oh, finally! Oh, this is the regular one, too. This isn't even a Bolero pickup. Now I can might get my son old sanctuary. Brownie has picked up nothing. Absolutely nothing. Is my toe maxed out? Sheena, two. No, Brad is two. Sheena is three. Oh my god, it's only level two. Yeah, that figures. Well, I can't burst burn you down with the NFT. Hmm. There's a lot of NFTs here. So Oh, died for my Tarakon sins. Hmm, if I get a candy box, I can get an Armadillo to get Bracer to get Thousand Edge up.
Blood rages at the thought of them. We all die for you. One for the many, and sometimes the many for the one. Oh, they're all just scooping around there. What am I doing? Stuff is maxed out, so I can actually start grabbing more. No, I could actually start grabbing everything. And then... In Scar? Why? Well... I know why. Burn! Burn! Why are you going for the Colonel? Vile! They are vile! Ooh, wow. BFC. There's a win and move. Hello. Da 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 da. I'm coming out with all the world to know. So let it flow. Oh, oh, oh. Do I have rapid fire on, or is this just as fast as I'm going? Oh. Wind scar has swung from overhead. I can't look like the wind scar. Power fist. This is the one that's the data slate that's cool. Oh, her stream has started 35 minutes ago. Wait, what the hell? But this is like three hours and 34 minutes into the VOD. Oh my god, our calendar is out of sync. Wait, no, I have a ton of things to pick up now. Boom, boom, level, level. Oh, there's still so much to go. There's my armadillo for Bracer. Oh, Halo 4, neat. Hopefully we get some saw action in Halo 4. Saw, 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 saw. Yeah, Hexbox. Wait, is Guardians Rod? Well, it's still sooner than if I waited. And there is the chance for something else to go. They really should not be stealing my bloody mini ghost. I should probably wait. It's on the stage. Will it take the mini ghost? Alright, now I go near the colonel to get that sweet, sweet stat boost in. And wait. Air blaster. <laughs> no repros here. Look at the colonel go. Maybe we all finally get an evolution. Hellfire? Huh. The Warhammer. Yeah, chest. No bad feeling. Only bad feeling. Humble. Oh, 
Hit them all. Crazy. In the darkness, burn them all. Hey, it's an arcana chest that accomplishes nothing. Yeah, I have armor. Hmm, maybe I should get awakening or beginning. Why not? Uh, add, 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 add. Great political ads on my fun account. My rage is hurting my teeth. Hey, it's sleeping time. I'm the sleep away today. God, I do not want to deal with it. God, it's bad enough that I feel forced to use Cross. And it's degenerated from awful to truly reprehensible monstrous. It's just constant, endless political garbage shoveled down your throat, even when you try and ban and stop it. I don't want to get political, but Elon Musk is a Leon Musk rat. And I don't care. Why am I invincible? Because I just have that many barriers. Yeah, well, that's a rant for another time. Servitor, servitor, servitor. They're all servitors, but they have different functions. They might have a different Mechanicus name. Man, why have I not gotten the bloody wave beam yet? Have you not maxed out armor? Arg, get over here. Machine spirit. Medical Servitor. I don't have big fuzzy fists either. What the hell is going on with the chest? Oh. Still not. Huh? Why is she... You okay. You're looking at some statues and thinking they're looking like Calgore? What? Like those robed ones with the sword and you No, know, that's very God. Oh boy, I know what she's doing. About to have a lot of trouble. Iron Jules of Death. Woo. Damn. My far coin. Okay, good. She called it not a scam, so I can trust her. 
And speaking of trust, death. Two million on that, because Sonic Bloom existed. Hellfire 5, 11 at Spellstream, and two million on the Flash Arrow. What a weird run. All right, it's time for some Mad Forest and with Brownie, Lance Bean, Ariana Spread Gun, and Brad Fang. Wow, that was right away. And we're on the Mad, Mad Forest, and in the background, I'm watching Matar Khan play some Space Marine 2. She's on her first Carnifex boss fight, woo, on the campaign. It's quite a rough one, because its hit detection is awful, as I know. Because, boy howdy, it wiped out three health bars instantly for me when I was playing in Operation before this recording. Well, not this one, but the earlier ones. And also after this is Dairy Plant, because, god, I have to hit all five of the large stages. Go figure. It's not like he even hit me with any of the Devour Blast. All physical stuff. I just dodge to the side. Whoops, hit you because the dodge animation is desynced. Dodge through. Whoop, immediate whip around for body damage. Well, oh, she's not doing well. Oh boy. Hard to practice against these things. And why do the cars keep showing up if they don't explode? Well, she got picked up, as you do, but... Oh my god, another frickin' ad. Oh, maybe it's because I keep pausing the video that's causing the issues. But man, this is a incredible amount of ads. Oi, Fyo. No. Oh man, I have Clock Lancet too. Oh, Empty Tome was picked up. Oh, you knocked right into me. Knocked the bat right into me. Ah, she hasn't actually fully gone down yet through Mortal Wounding. Oh, there's our cop. Wait, why is she restarting? Oh, oh, she just restarted from checkpoint. The way she was acting was like restart the full dang level. Not have been fast. Can't beat a Carnifex acutely. It's too ugly for it. It's awesome till the hit detection messes with you. Oh, I asked it. Well, I got some Melise Saver here. There's that, at least. I need that sign old Sanctuary ASAP. Drowny can't compete with its 11 damage. Oh, there's two of them. Double Arcana. Ripple or, or no wait. You're right. There's three of them now. Three goblins just moseying about. Good, you're frozen, and Brad's gonna do some damage. Now he's gonna do even more damage. Cause my silent old sanctuary is here. Goody goody goom drops. Time for some mad groobin'. By that, I mean Sapphire Miss. Ooh, double attack, double attack. Look at Brad go. Brad Fang! That's the coolest character. A cyborg werewolf man. How can you beat that? You can't. You can't. All right, let's make sure the other controllers don't disconnect inexplicably. Their batteries are a fall. Oh wow, Fiverr. Nito Papino.
Yeah. It's easy to miss when it's actually shooting the spikes out, even though it being stuck on the ground is very obvious. It's just they're hard to see when it's they're small and green like that. Like a lot of the, actually the, hmm. basically everything else that shoots a projectile glows heavily when they do. It makes it very obvious. Her cuffs and yawning. And that's the content quality you come here for. I don't think anyone watches this far. Well, let me know down below if it is you watching down this far. We're here. We're crowning. Oh, stop swearing. This is a family friendly video recording that no one can hear but me. Yep. Isn't that crazy? Oh, she didn't manage to execute it. She just went for the gun strike on the Carnifex. Yippee skippy. Ooh, duplicator. First try after your first loss. Nope, well, Mori managed to beat Pontifex Sullivan. It's double spoilers on her first attempt. Still think uh, Twin Princess, Dragon Slayer armor. Those will definitely take life. Oh, Champ Gundir, definitely. Uh, Nameless King, probably. Nameless King, definitely. Ancient Drake. Ancient Wyvern, just because, yeah, you're going to almost no one ever beats that first try just because they don't know what to do. I mean, I came close, but I actually messed up the plunging attack. Just because I whacked it a few times, saw I do no damage, like, okay, this is a gimmick fight, isn't it? Promise trained me too well. I stalker. No, space marines don't get in trouble. They can't even get drunk. What trouble can they get into? My god, Ad. It's crazy amount of ads. That's gotta be YouTube automating it. Ouch. Now, I have another YouTube account. Platinum account. It's the one I actually watch a lot of stuff with. Well, I watch it on the TV because I don't want to deal with ads on the TV. But I also keep it. Another one for whomever. Wait, is this fraud? No. I mean, most people have multiple channels. But, you know, I chat with my Mezzine Around account and watch on the TV with the other one. Never talk, never chat, no what video watch, no, no chat, no talk, no comments, no nothing on that one, no subs, no anything, a pure algorithm. Pure algorithm. I get annoyed very easily because I'm an impatient fop. Balance. Flow. Alrighty. Halfway there. Oh wait, I have wave beam. I can stand still. Wait, where the hell? Wait, what it? Did I didn't get weapon pick up on brownie. Really? Hmm. Hmm. 
finisher. Oh, you can gun strike anything and execute. No, you can't. Uh. Ooh, co op. Uh, if only the dodges were better. Wait, why am I not grabbing this chest? Remember the card effects? It should be just a little bit till the siege section, shouldn't it? I need to check the achievements for Marine Space Marine to see if it's feasible. The PvP ones are probably gonna be the ones that are annoying, uh, but like data slates. Probably class mapping. Then some stuff for PvP. That'd be too difficult. I don't think there's any difficult achievements for main campaign. Yep, switched up Dark Tide. I never played it. I wanted to play it, but then it took forever to come out on Xbox. My computer at the time could not handle it. Well, probably could have, but I wouldn't have been able to stream or whatnot. Well, granted, this was before I wanted to start streaming, huh? Yeah, Dark Day came out in 2002, or 2022, didn't it? 2023 is when I started streaming, huh? So I could have done stuff, right? No, it's because it came out in 2022, then 2023 just started pumping out banger after banger, which I played first, because it was taking forever to come out on Xbox. Then it finally did, and I was busy with other stuff. That's what happened. But heck, maybe if I finished Space Marine 2, I could go on to Dark Tide. Well, hope I can go on to Dark Tide. Uh, I just keep complaining. I need an event so I don't do worse stuff and start attacking random people in real life. Gotta release the stress! It's close enough to breaking through as it is. Ta da! 4.30 to go. So many rapid, rapid fires. Yeah, just some nids on the way to the generator defense. No, wait. On the way to the computer, then the generator defense. Defend all the generators. Why are they even jumping into the generators? Aiming is overrated. Who needs skill? Only Clodden. Only Clodden. Yeah, Barney doesn't move his gun and shoot it like a lot of the others. And odd. Another bloody ad. Okay, what nonsense is this? This looks like an ad for Alaska. Oh, there's a tractor, and I don't think there's many tractors in Alaska, but what do I know? Hockey. Northern Lights, so okay, yeah, this has to be some sort of commercial for Alaska. I guess. Granted, what's more confusing is the sheer lack of proper face in here, care, but hey. It's obviously in a commercial film that Alaska is just supposed to pretend to be in Alaska. Yes, yes, it's very impressive. Let's get to the ad already. What are you promoting? I must know so I can ignore it. Look, I can dip my hand in freezing cold water, but I doubt said person over here can.
No, it's for Canada. At least the Deadpool vs. Wolverine makes more sense. Well, why are you spoiling that? I mean, I knew it was there. Man, it's actually kind of incredible. Leon Digital. Well, I wonder if one of that and their streaming services have that. I really wanted to watch Transformers 1, but, well. Well. Anyway, I know it was a dig in the first X-Men movie about the yellow spandex, but man, did they make it look so good in Deadpool and Wolverine. Like, so good. You just get the body, perfect, great body proportions, and yes, even those kind of comical looking comic costumes can look good. Like, Peacemaker's costume is goofy as all hell, but man, did John Cena actually make it work. Oh yeah, also Matara Khan is playing. But why do that when I can talk about random ads? Alberta. Who wants to move to Alberta? Like, no one was wearing hats in the middle of winter covering their ears. You, you can't fool me. I've lived in winter. You are clearly not filming correctly in winter. You are lying to me. I could deal with that. A child is not going to deal with that. I don't even want to deal with not having my head covered. Cover your ears. Cover your fingers. Cover your feet. Everything else is basically superfluous. I do mean that. As someone who basically went out half in a tank top and shorts all the time to shovel snow for hours and came in perfectly warm. Just got to... Get those extremities going. Oh, well. She's on an elevator. Witten, Mad Forest. Ten, five, four, ten. Huh. It's time for more Space Marine 2 with Captain Titus. A horse, Mago Impostorina, and Bill Riser. I already forgot what I was doing with this gimmick. Uh, also, I'm playing Brownie, and yes, I did bounce back up to them because Horse and Mago Arena had already completed all those other stages. It's very weird, this section. But here it is with a dairy plant. Can't milk a robot. And in the background, Matara Khan's playing Space Marine 2, and I'm reacting to her doing that. Just went up an elevator ride after a boss fight. To get some data to find actually where Luz is, because I actually got it wrong where she was going. Ooh. Greatest Jubilee on Brownie. That's very good. That basically means I win. Greatest of Jubilees. Save me. Alright, cutscene. Where the truth is revealed. Praise the machine spirit. Robo. Bug. Like Power Rangers, Mega Force, kind of, sort of, maybe. Who's? I lose. Get the relic. Look at the relic. Open the file. Bully that machine spirit. Titus. Hey! Yay! Another ad. Just what I always wanted in my life. And God. Pausing it definitely does affect it, but still. Holy crap. And more ads in this video than... How many other videos? I still haven't watched many a true nerd play either. He's always a good guy to follow. 
it was not destroyed. Uh oh. That will not look familiar, Matarakan. Battle Barge. That was the first game, and also Bolt Gun, apparently. I never played a Bolt Gun. It looked really neat. Actually, isn't it on Game Pass? Huh. Anyway, my Sanctuary of Silence and Old is here. I so gotta remember to actually cut this before I do anything else. Oh, about three hours still posting. Oh, we're down the reactor machine, spirit. Man. <laughs> so if they hadn't actually wandered in here, the nids would have just blown up the reactor and the whole dang hive would have gone up. Wild luck there. Wild luck. But nothing in Space Marine 2 sucks. It's all slashing and biting. And chewing. Only now. For now. The future is better than the present. Boom, boom. No throwing yourself in the reactor, Matarka. No throwing yourself in the reactor. Play Space Marine 2, then Dark Tide. Here they come. Legally, you're not a tyrant, but in spirit, you are, Matara. Serpent. I wish I was good at any game like this, Stripping Guy. Yay, many red. You know what I think about that sniper round is it didn't give me the frickin' XP for the gun I was using. Why? Blast. Ooh, there's my Arcana Goblin. I do have sign old sanctuary. Here we go. Grabby grabby. Double attacks. I love double attacks. Give me Sapphire Cries. And Sapphire Mist, more importantly. We got some Leeson's, so that's no trouble. Man, I just have, like, the exact same Arcana set up the entire time, don't I? The Bolero is just too much of a power bringer. Especially for the multiplayer with what I'm running. Blow up those Tyranids! Destroy them all. <laughs> Burn and fire. Burn and bloom. Huh, triple armor. Where did that 900 come from? I guess Megal Arena is hitting for... Maybe I got the 99 confused for a 900. Hats, hats everywhere doing nothing. And miss gun strike if something moves in an awkward way. I got some idle showdown tomorrow. Oh, uh, what do we got? In my future, I'll showdown tomorrow. And there's always more vampire survivors. Yay! Very close to ending out the fifth wave. Then it'll be the Melise videos in our mission, and then moving on to the sixth wave, which I have even less of an idea of what's going to be happening. 
Even the fifth wave is pretty lazy compared to the fourth wave. Very lazy. Uh, it's bound to be something more interesting than just one character wandering around, maybe. I mean, going around the map getting stuff. That's the interesting thing. And watching the numbers go higher and higher. Till the end of time. Use that plasma incinerator. Burn the bugs. Don't forget about that weird fuel coil thing. Fusion core. Oh, no, not here. Fusion core is in Halo. Halo 3, mostly. Throw that fusion core. Throw it good. Sniper, let him cannon. Up oh, zone throops. Double zone throop fire. And she's got a plasma pistol. And the incinerator, so she should be fine. Check the core. Uh oh. Ah, uh, sun locked in a corner. Oh, I need to go grab chess. Long gunning. For the shorter guy. Chesto. Let's get every one of my pickups here. That's clearly a good idea and not a waste of a lot of power. Oh, maybe it was a grenade or rosary that did that 900 I was looking at. Oh. Okay, so if you interrupt the Phoenix Blast by moving, any ones you will have stocked up. Oh man, fight. Man, it takes a while to fire out. Okay, so... That's how it works. It fires out a set number of projectiles for the Phoenix Blast, and you can interrupt it, and it'll store those till the next time you don't move. 1%. Win at 1%? Woo. Where is what I want? Beginning. That helps everyone. Oh, wow. Uh, looks like she might have actually won. 1% health on the core. Wait, reactor shut down. Oh, is that just phase one? Don't create. Finish, finish it. Volkite. Oh, hey, that's like the pistol. Okay, pistol. From the heresy. God, I've still got so long to go on this. I've already won. Just let me die already. I'm the heretic. Hey, emergency meeting. Nimroth. More barriers and a vacuum. Chaos. Oh wait, she never learned what uh, the chaos gods were all spawned by the evils of man's. They're well, except Slanesh. Uh, not sure why they were only spawned by man. Can't remember whether Corn or Zeech is older. Uh. Then after that is Nurgle, then Slanesh was... Heck, it's technically younger than the Imperium. Uh, 
Uh, but then Slanesh was caused by Kizum. Then all the other smaller minor chaos gods that basically never matter. Geo up as they come. Uh, who was it? Scarbond. Doombreed? Yeah, Scarbond's the strongest, quote, bloodthirster for corn. Then Doombreed is the second one. And Doombreed is Genghis Khan. Or was Genghis Khan, it might have changed. Yes. Yes. Drama. Drama, Matarakan. Stompy stomp. Activate Halo. Oh, Ghoulaman's ambitions. I mean, they need to take the rest to defeat it with how bad things have gone. Oh, man, you never know what's going to be true or not. Boom. Phoenix Blastin. Cool Man and Johnson are both back in play. The rest of the missing ones are still missing as far as I'm aware. For Prime Arcs, Loyalists, they're all still lost in the webway or the warp or whatnot. And whatever the hell is going on with Vulcan living and dying and whatnot. He's super duper immortal. And that great Jubilee is firing out so many pickups. Well, oh, should get the hunt K at least. Robo arm. Oh my god, am I gonna need another ad? No, you two just being dopey. Uh, uh, <laughs> yeah. Oh, uh, boy, what's my marks? Uh, Sanguinus and Ferris Magnus are super duper dead. Johnson and Rope Bear Gulaman are back in play. And everyone else is just missing. Yeah. Four of X is lost. Even Russ is lost. Oracle Dorn is lost, Shingle Khan is lost, and then Vulcan is question marky coming back and whatnot. The end times are coming, that's when Lehman Russ will return. And for Chaos, Angorn was just sort of always fighting stuff. Magnus the Red kind of doesn't care, he's totally checked out. Fulgrim's trapped in a mirror or, or something. Horus is super dead. Conrad Cruz is also super dead. Nefarious and Omegon are confusing. Uh, Mortarian doesn't do anything. Petro doesn't do anything. And Lorgar is active. Lorgar and Angorn are basically doing a lot of stuff. Just randomly attacking and breaking stuff. Actually doing lead and stuff. Laser blast. La 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 laser blast. She crashed the game. Oh, she just restarted the checkpoint on the battle large. Oh, what was that? 17k. Yeah. Yeah, so. Well, that's an odd way to end this. Her were you watching a cutscene? I just talked about it. And also two. 21 Primarchs, 20 Legions, and then two just removed from records. Yeah.
18 mil, one L, four, 14. And there we go. There we go. And after that level of wackiness, we're down. 1,269 complete on the Beswick. And 686 more to go. 600. So we're two thirds of the way is done. Probably not. But it's close. I think next up, it's actually just dropping down a bit to Probotector. And we'll actually get some more Capella Magna action going on there. 1270. Until next time. Thanks for watching. I hope you had some fun. Please like, dislike, comment, or subscribe if you haven't. The support keeps me going. Thanks to everyone who already has. Either way, I hope everyone has a good day and you keep messing around in the Vampire Survivors Bezwick.